graphics cards are boring. I mean, so what do they have a lot of compute power and can make cool stuff appear on your screen? These things are old news. What you really want is a graphics card that's also SSD. Or at least kind of, because ASUS recently showed off a pretty cool example of what else can be put onto a graphics card. Because yes, they put two M.2 slots on an RTX 4060 Ti. Which hey, that's always just two more slots that the user can take advantage of, and it's less space wasted on the motherboard itself for additional M.2 storage. But I know what you're asking. What the is the point of that? I mean, that just sounds so dumb. And true, at first, it might sound really, really dumb and pointless. However, there's some really good reasons for why this could actually be a pretty cool thing. And a lot of it simply comes down to bandwidth. Because a lot of these lower tier cards actually require so little bandwidth that they don't actually need to be 16x Gen 4. A lot of them are actually just 8x. They literally have half the lanes because they don't need any more. So how about using a bandwidth that is otherwise wasted on a GPU and using it for some extra storage instead, which, given the size of current games, that is never a bad thing. And there are some other great benefits, for example, if implemented correctly and it's easy to access, M.2 storage on the graphics card could be such a game changer because normally these M.2 slots are hidden away underneath the graphics card on the motherboard and thus it's going to make access to them so much easier. Not to mention the fact that as SSDs are getting hotter and hotter, well they'll be able to take advantage of the pretty efficient cooling solutions available on these graphics cards which is also going to be absolutely huge. Though now that I say that out loud, I imagine there'll be at least one person out there mad at this because they want all the cooling going towards the graphics card and I don't want any SSD taking away the precious, precious performance from the GPU. Either way, it's still a pretty cool concept that I could actually see going beyond the prototype stage and into something that you, yes you, could actually buy. But is it actually a good idea? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. But before you comment, also check out our Patreon, because in a single dollar month truly goes a long way, well you get awesome perks as well. I'd also like to thank my extinct patrons, Gavin Burns, LKB, Justin Rage, Elavronek, Bullish Roka, Max Sumner, Shane Allcroft, Lansby, and Level Up. Down is gonna find our merch store, our Discord server, and our social media links as well. But anyway, that's about it, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye everyone. Good. Bye.